So guys, Demetrius Andrade, Andrade, um, great performance. Uh, is Andrade, I think, sorry, I keep butchering his name, Andrade, Demetrius Andrade um, gets uh, a stoppage, 12th round stoppage, lucky to get the stoppage, I thought the other guy, Akov, Akov uh, was unlucky, he shouldn't have got a stop, the referee shouldn't have jumped in, but it was what it was, um, you know, you, uh, Demetrius Andrade Andr 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 was outclassing the guy, easy, it was easy work for him, uh, he, was on a, he was on a different level to... Um, um, Akovov, you know, the, I think that, that Akovov is a guy that, you know, fought Billy Joe and gave Billy Joe a hard time, but that was because Billy Joe wasn't dedicated at that point. He just went in and, you know, it was a, it was a terrible performance by Billy Joe. It wasn't because that other guy was so good. It was just that Billy Joe wasn't on it. And we've seen that from Billy Joe previously, but, you know, uh, you know, Billy Joe's obviously a, a, a way better fighter than that guy. It was just, like I said, he was overweight or out of shape. He didn't train that hard for that fight. And that's why that guy gave him such a tough fight. But in terms of him being, you know, Andre, Andre you know, Andre's dedicated. Obviously, he came on point and he's on another level to um, Akovov. It was it was blatant to see. Um, I think in terms of what Andre is going to do next, it's going to be very interesting to see uh, because uh, Andre called out Golovkin. Um, and you know that'd be a great fight because Golovkin's getting older. He's not the fighter he was, and and um, you know I think that would be a great matchup. I think can Andre uh, be able to use his skills to outbox someone like Golovkin? I think he can, but I don't know for how long. I don't think I don't think uh, he'll be able to stay in there for Golovkin with twelve rounds. I think Golovkin gets to him and probably stops him. If I'm honest, because um, Golovkin's still a world class fighter. And I, I, what I've seen so far from Andre. He doesn't look like anything special. Like, you know, uh, I think Billy Joe and Andre would be a very good fight. Uh, both slick fires. I would favour Billy Joe in that fight. Uh, if Billy Joe's on it and on his A game and, you know, come prepared. Um, but, you know, Andre made a very uh, good point about Billy Joe. That Obviously, we knew that he, we know that he was using this nasal spray. How, how much was that helping him make weight? Because we saw for his last fight, he was so overweight. He was like 175. I don't know whether... That nasal spray was helping Billy Joe cut weight. I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I'm only speculating. Uh, but if Billy Joe's able to make weight and make weight well without that, whatever that he was using, um, you know, or may, I don't know how. I'm not like a doctor. I don't know what, you know, what that drug, uh, what kind of effect. I know that it was uh, a drug that helps you lose or the, the enhancing drug that he was taking, that nasal spray was helping him lose weight. So obviously Billy Joe's someone that's quite a big middleweight. He struggled. He, I don't think it's easy for him to make weight, but I think that's also how he lives between camps. I think he, he puts on a lot of weight, so it's a lot hard for him to lose weight. Um, but yeah, I think that would be a great fight, Andre and Billy Joe. Like I said, I'd favour Billy Joe. I'd favour Golovkin massively in a, in a fight with Andre, if I'm honest. I'd favour him quite heavily. Um, but I think... I do think that, um, you know, you could cause Golovkin a pro problem early on, but eventually I think Golovkin will catch up to him. And that's just my opinion. But leave your thoughts, guys. Let me know what you thought of Demetrius Andre's performance. Uh, and who do you think he should fight next? Leave your thoughts, guys. And guys, remember to please like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.